This is a quick demo on how to make an assembly so that you can drag a particular part along a predefined path and you could also make an animation for that. In this case I'll use a chain following a path similar to um, the path a bike chain would uh, take. So this is a small segment of the chain here and I'll show you how to add some links here. I already have the links in here, I just have to unsuppress them. On this link though, there's only a concentric mate to the link before it, so I need to give it a mate so that it'll follow this path. If I go to mates, advanced mates, cam, select cam follower, pick this point here, and for this will right click here and do select tangency so it'll select all the faces of that path and then we're finished with that mate so now it'll follow, follow the same path that uh, we've already predefined in this case this path is rather large so if we open this part which is just a sketch with a surface extrude we'll change the uh, size of that, you know, update back into the assembly. So let's get rid of this. Let's do 25 here. Let's do 5 inches. And we'll make this um, 50. So now it's much smaller than it was before. We'll click OK save that part and go back into the assembly now it's a much smaller path so using a parametric path like that is uh, very simple to do now if we want to do an animation we click down here go to the animation tab do a new animation drag this out to here or set the time frame at four seconds and then grab this link and pull to there now if we push play the chain will follow this path and that's the quick and simple way to make a part follow a predefined path in SOLIDWORKS